Kelly Osbourne's new look has been the talk of the town recently, and not only because she ditched her gothic makeup and shaved hair. The star revealed her dramatic 85 pound weight loss back in 2020, and she had fans shocked. More recently, after some of Kelly's Instagram posts, many followers feel that she's unrecognizable and believe she must have had plastic surgery done even on her face. She has been sporting a more natural look than we're used to, wearing fitted clothes as well as longer hair, but it shouldn't come as a surprise that Kelly would change since starring on her family's reality show The Osbournes was way back in the early 2000s. That was a long time ago. While Kelly has denied getting plastic surgery done, she did admit to getting a gastric sleeve weight loss surgery back in 2018, claiming it was the best thing she's ever done. Um, I just want to bring up a topic that you guys are all talking about because I'm always really honest and really upfront about what I've done to my body and who I am. And I have not had plastic surgery. I've never done anything to my face other than a couple of injections in my lips, in my jaw, and in my forehead here. I do not lie, but thank you for the compliment. Not to mention, Kelly has changed her lifestyle completely between exercise, embracing a vegan diet, and getting sober. Hey guys, it's Kara the Vampire Slayer, and I'm bringing you another celebrity before and after. In this video, we're going to be breaking down Kelly Osbourne's physical transformation over the years, from her gothic days to starring on her family's reality show to her brand new look. We'll talk about her drastic weight loss surgery, any plastic surgery she's had done, as well as her new way of life. We've recently dropped a few other videos in this series, including one on Zac Efron as well as Elliot Page. As always, be sure to let us know whose before and after is up next, and I'll see you all after the intro. Kelly Michelle Lee Osborne was born on October 27, 1984, and is a TV personality, actress, singer, model, and more. As the daughter of Ozzy and Sharon Osborne, she's well known for being on their family reality TV show, The Osbournes, from 2002 to 2005, and she's gone on to land some other TV gigs since then. Kelly's also been a judge in Project Runway Junior since 2015, and on Australia's Got Talent. On the Osborne series, her family's day-to-day -day life was the focus, portraying them as dysfunctional, with metal music, profanity, and the like being normal occurrences around their home. Kelly, the middle child, was seen as a funny, brutally honest, potty mouth spitfire according to Rolling Stone, and the series began when she was only 17, ending when she was 20. Later on, Kelly had admitted that having a crew and constant cameras around was super stressful while growing up those years. On April 2nd, 2004, Osborne entered the Malibu rehab facility Promises after telling her family she was addicted to painkillers, and a year later, she changed checked into La Cincina's Hospital, a drug treatment center in Pasadena after a relapse. A few more relapses would come in the following years along with more time in treatment. Recently, Kelly has opened up with the start of her struggles with addiction when she was only 13. Her relationship with drugs and alcohol allegedly began when she was prescribed an opioid medication after undergoing a surgery. She said, I kept getting sick and I had a really bad case of tonsillitis. They ended up having to give me some crazy surgery and then after that, they gave me Vicodin. In, and that was all I needed. Kelly claims it made her confident and happy, then jumping from Vicodin to Percocet and eventually to heroin because she said it was cheaper. While Kelly has turned her life around, she admitted to fans that she recently did relapse after four years of sobriety but is now back on track. So while Kelly's shocking new look has a lot to do with her healthier lifestyle and drastic changes in that department, you can't help but notice her face looks a lot different too. In recent Instagram photos, questions have been raised about whether or not Kelly Kelly had any plastic surgery done in her face. In December, she denied speculation from fans, saying that she never touched her face in terms of going under the knife, but did admit to some Botox and injections. Kelly has claimed she does get injections on her lips, which would be the cause of the plump look, as well as injections in her cheeks and on her forehead. While some commenters on Kelly's Instagram continue to say that injections still mean plastic surgery, they're really not the same thing. Additionally, another procedure that gave the star a new look, or at least had something to do with it, was jaw surgery. She got work done because she had problems with the joints in her jaw and explained. I had really bad TMJ. One of the things they did to stop it was they gave me injections in my jaw. It kind of made my jaw look skinnier. That's when people started to notice that I had really lost 
wig because it changed the shape of my everything. Definitely the thing that changed Kelly's look the most was her drastic weight loss. She revealed her 85 pound weight loss last summer, posting a photo while shopping at Neiman Marcus captioned, yes, I'm bragging because I worked hard and it feels good, which was showing off size 26 jeans she was purchasing. It's no secret that Kelly underwent gastric sleeve weight loss surgery in 2018. She's been very vocal and open about it, even going so far as to say it was the best thing she'd ever done. This surgery is a procedure which removes 75 to 80% of the stomach, resulting in weight loss. And in Kelly's case, she lost 85 pounds. In 2020, Kelly talked about her gastric sleeve surgery, saying, I did the gastric sleeve. All it does is change the shape of your stomach. I got that almost two years ago. I will never, ever lie about it, ever. It is the best thing I have ever done. She also noted that the procedure is different from a gastric bypass since the one she had done can cause weight gain if the patient doesn't follow up with a healthy diet and regular exercise. According to Kelly, it was far from a quick fix and also demanded she change her lifestyle. She further explained, all it does is move you in the right direction. So anyone who's thinking of doing something like this, really think about that. I had to do a year of standalone therapy to prepare myself for the surgery before I even had it. Of course, Kelly's major weight loss transformation took many years, not just the gastric sleeve surgery. She told the Hollywood Raw podcast she did a year of therapy prior to the surgery, which worked to stop her addiction issues and prevent her from emotional eating. This was a big way that the star began to adopt a new way of life, of course, with diet and exercise. Kelly goes for regular walks for exercise and embraced her vegan diet. After appearing on Dancing with the Star, in 2009, Kelly had dropped 40 pounds due to a combination of her dance rehearsals and switching to a plant-based diet. While in 2012, she became completely vegan. Not to mention, Kelly says her new lifestyle has a lot to do with working on herself from within. She explained, The number one thing I had to do is get happy. I had to fix my head before I could fix my body. You can never go into this if you're not in a good mindset. I stopped drinking, which is the best thing I've ever done. I really wanted to fix the things that were broken in me. Earlier this year, Kelly did admit to a relapse and said that she thought she could handle herself with life going well. She claimed to have went on a binge for a few days, saying she thought she could be normal and have a few drinks, but must realize she can never have a normal relationship with alcohol. But after that, Kelly's right back on track. What do you guys think about Kelly's transformation and her new look? Do you think she got work done on her face that she's keeping a secret or no? I think she's being honest like she usually is and definitely looks amazing. My name is Kara the Vampire Slayer and that wraps it up for this before and after. After talking all about Kelly Osbourne over the years, were you shocked at her dramatic weight loss and new look? Be sure to drop me a comment down below so we can discuss and tell me who else we should do a before and after video on. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram and I will see you all in the next video. Bye!